Hey guys, K9 here today. Back at it again with another video, and today we are going to be playing Fazbear Entertainment Storage. This game caught my eye because it was Five Nights at Freddy's 2 related, and because of that, it obviously piqued my interest. Make sure you guys leave a like and a comment down below telling me on how your guys' day has been. And with that being said, we'll get on with the video. Whoa, 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 what the heck was that? Was it? It told me to press the control. I didn't even know what it was. Whoa! If you're hearing this message, I wanted to thank you oh, again for taking the job. I needed this position filled on very short notice, and your application couldn't have been more perfectly timed. My name is Henry, and like I informed you earlier, you will be receiving pre-recorded messages from me whenever you start heck? a new shift. These messages will be used to help guide you through the week, or at least until you get your bearings. The building you're currently in is a storage facility which holds relics from a once popular children's pizzeria chain. The last pizzerias in this chain have been closed for a while now, mm -hmm. and most of the objects in this building are even older than that. So this place has gone unwatched for quite some time. Regardless, all the equipment inside the building should still be suitably functional. Now, I'm afraid this job won't be as simple as sitting around in your office and checking cameras. Okay. This building houses several decommissioned animatronic animals that once entertained children in those aforementioned pizzerias. Despite all the money that was poured into them, they were scrapped due to perceived malfunctions. I had my gripes about this choice. But regardless, they have been stored here for a while now. For most of that time, they've been gathering dust. However, lately, I've been seeing signs of activity inside the building. Yeah, I have reason to believe that someone has been tampering with the decommissioned animatronics and is attempting to reactivate them. Now, I don't think you'll have to worry about encountering whoever has been tampering with the animatronics during your shift. You should be more worried about the animatronics themselves. These animatronics were designed to freely walk around the building and entertain guests. And if someone has been actively tampering with them, it's likely that they'll be walking around the building during your shift. Right. Now, I'm not sure what changes have been made to their AI, and that means I don't know how they'll react to the side of you. With that in mind, we should prevent them from reaching you. You have a few tools at your disposal to help make it through your shift. You have been provided a camera panel that lets you remotely access all the building's cameras. Use these cameras to keep an eye on the animatronics and ensure none of them are moving. There is a separate set of cameras placed inside the air vents of the building. Right, which office, is right here. Right, is a building status panel. You can use this to stay aware of the current status of the building's various systems. Most important is the building's power. Your yeah, power what is this? Your supply is limited and is consumed by several systems in the building. Your cameras do not consume additional power, as okay. they run on a separate, unrestricted supply. Once the building's power supply reaches critical levels, several systems will shut down, such as the building's lights. With this in mind, you have also been provided with a flashlight to help illuminate the dark corners of your office. Right. Your flashlight has its own separate battery, which... Obviously unaffected oh! by the building's power. In addition, she's on the move. Been provided with a mask of one of the pizzeria's mascots. Yeah, the is that used to counter all them again? Were once outfitted with advanced facial recognition software. If they get close enough to see you, you should keep them from recognizing you as human. Now, I'm not sure if the facial recognition is still functional on each of the animatronics, and it's not impossible. Uh oh. That the mask won't work on any of them. But regardless, if any of them have their old facial recognition software still in use, the mask should protect you from them. That's why I thought. Assuming the mask doesn't work, you have a few other options to protect yourself. Okay, where are you they? You have an air vent that runs through your office. Yes. In the event that something undesirable were to crawl through it, you can close its opening to your office using a button. Keeping this closed does drain power, so don't leave it shut longer than you need to. I know it's a fairly makeshift solution, but I only had so much time to install it before your first shift. This should be all the information you need for your first night. Remember, your shift ends at 6, and at that point, you are expected to leave. Do not 
stay any longer than you need to. I'll have another message for you recorded before your next shift. Okay. Good luck. All right then. Man, I have not seen a Five Nights at Freddy's fan game this clean. The vent, okay? Like, the fan yeah. has its, like, why is it so smooth on the animation? But I have Toy Bonnie and Toy Chica heading after me. So Toy Bonnie, I'm expecting to be right there. Toy Chica, I'm expecting to be in the vents really soon. But what the heck? I don't know if you guys could see the building power, but the building power is halfway if my face cam is in the way. But... Okay, I heard that. But no one's there. That means Torchika walked in. Oh! That is awesome! What the heck? I didn't even notice her in that camera. Oh, okay. Oh, that is so clean what the heck I'm not gonna stop saying that I'm not gonna stop saying that okay okay that was a very very self-explanatory kind of thing that we just had to go through holy crap oh this is awesome <laughs> let's go with night two okay let's see what the night guard has to say or the person calling us Congratulations on completing your first shift. However, if I am correct in my assumption that these animatronics are being actively tampered with, I'm afraid your job is likely to increase in difficulty as the week continues. Oh yeah, of course. I will do my best to slowly introduce you to your responsibilities here, so as not to overwhelm you. Good. I'd like to take this moment to remind you about the functionality of this building's power. In the event that you encounter a building-wide power outage, do not assume that you are defenseless. Your cameras operate on a separate power supply and will continue to function even if the building goes dark, although you may not be able to see much. Your uh, flashlight battery is not tied to any other system and can therefore continue to be used to brighten up your office once the lights shut down. Your mask is, of course, unaffected by a loss of power. Of course, However, yeah. that does not mean that you should not worry if the building loses power. You will be unable to seal any openings in the building's ventilation system so including the, the one located in your office, and all currently sealed vents will open. Further, the three main cooling fans located in the vents, which maintain the building's temperature, will immediately shut down, and your office will begin to heat rapidly. Oh. Please, keep this in mind. You will receive a more thorough explanation on the cooling fans tomorrow night. Okay. Good luck. It. End message. So, let's see. Man, why is that like Toy Chica has like a giraffe looking neck? Am I wrong though? So if the power were to run out on the building, we still have the flashlight, we still have the mask, we just can't close the vent. Oh my goodness, all three of them are there. Okay, well, either way, either way, either way. Okay, so we know how to deal with Toy Bonnie. Toy Bonnie is just like... Oh, that meant that Toy Chica moved. And no one seems to be in the vents. So cam three. No, no one's here yet. Okay, so Toy Bonnie's going to be there soon. But where's Toy Chica? Because... I don't know, is she... Is she going to be like our vent rat? Okay. Oh, please. Oh my gosh. I reacted way too slow. I was going to press the button on the vent, but then I put the mask on. But then I felt like as soon as I would take off the mask. Ah, man, okay. Gotta be quick on the vent. Considering that I've seen only Mangle, Toy Chica, Toy Freddy, Toy Bonnie, I wonder if like Balloon Boy marinette i wonder if those two are going to be around and i haven't seen any of the withered animatronics worst part is, is that we don't even have a clock to tell what time it is or no wait we do what the heck 
Okay, so two of them are in there. Toy Freddy's over there. Wrangle's right there. So no one's really... No one's really doing anything yet. Oh yeah, that's right. So, man, I wonder how... I wonder if there's gonna be like another button or something. Oh, great. She's already gonna be approaching us real soon. I'm only getting a little... No, we're not dealing with that again. Oh, okay. Everyone else is moving too. Oh. I think that's how... Oh my gosh, what do I do about you? Dude, hurry up, hurry up. You gone? Oh my gosh. Dude, please go. Dude, believe! Oh. That was awfully close. Dude, what do I do about you? He's just not doing me any harm. I feel like I need my mask on just to get rid of him. No. Do we just gotta camp him out like this? Because I'm not sure what the play is. Like, I don't know if I'm supposed to do anything like... Do I need to hold the flashlight? But I feel like if I hold it, that's what's gonna make him kill me. No. Oh my, are you serious? No, this is bringing me flashbacks to the original game where night two used to be my hardest night to go through. Am I supposed to like hold the flashlight on him? Because that seems to be the only thing making him move. I wonder. Cause now I know how to deal with Okay. So I know how to deal with Toy Bonnie. And I know how to deal with Toy Chica. But I don't know how to deal with Toy Freddy. Which, I mean... We'll see where that goes. So, Toy Freddy, I'm just gonna experiment with him. Hold that on. So it's the flashlight that makes him go away. So now we know what to do. So... Toy Freddy's afraid of the light. Toy Bonnie only goes here. Toy Chica only goes in the vents. So I'm really curious as to who or what our next animatronic is going to do. Okay. Well, we already got you covered. There we go. 5 a.m. We got this. Oh, they were all in there for a second. For the most part, I think we should be fine. But I gotta keep note that like what are... Oh yeah, we got you covered. Okay. We gotta keep in mind like what our manager told us that there's two batteries. Two batteries. I mean, we already know what those are, but yeah, oh my goodness. Come on, night three. I gotta see what's going on on night three. So, now how does our fan system work? I wonder if Mangle has to do with that. Oh. Either way, let's hear out the manager. Excellent work these past two nights. That being said, I would like to take this time to warn you about another system listed in your status panel. Yeah, please. The building's temperature. Explain it. The temperature of the room you're currently in is maintained by three large fans within the ventilation system, which are constantly running. Yes. If these fans were to in any way malfunction, the building's oh. temperature would begin to heat up rapidly. You are able to seal access to the fans remotely through your camera panel. Sealing vents will not affect the building's temperature. However, Having a vent sealed will drain power. The operational status of all three fans are listed on your status panel at all times. Keep this information in mind. I trust that this new information won't be too much for you to handle. I'll have another message for you tomorrow. Oh my, that scared the crap out Good of luck. me. And 
message. Okay, so I just noticed that as he was talking, uh, before I even press this guy, the half squares are the ones with uh, fans. But the ones that aren't don't have any, you know, toggle things. Now, we just gotta go take a look at everything. The fans seem to be doing all right. Okay, chill. Try to sneak on me, dude. Got you covered. Oh, you're gone. Okay, uh, where's Mangle? I need to find you real quick. Okay, you're right there. Oh, you are so going to be there, though. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where's Balloon Boy? Hello. Hello. Oh, you're right there. Okay. Go. Dude, how do I deal with Mangle? Do I have to just play it on, like, FNAF 3? Someone's there. Still chilling on the main power line. Dude, please. I really hope Balloon Boy doesn't have a jump scare. Okay, Mangle's getting dangerously close. All right, hold on. Let me deal with you real quick. Oh, I gotta watch out for that freaking. <sighs> gotta watch out for him. Because who knows what Blue Boy's up to? Gonna like steal all my power and whatnot. Hold on. Let me talk about that seal real quick. Just in case. Dude, where do you come from though? Go. Someone's there. Okay. Ooh. He's creepy as hell. Did y'all just see him run across my seat? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I think that's how I deal with Mangle. Think it is the seal. And no, hold on. Gotta deal with you real quick. Great, I ran out. I ran out of power. That's great. Toggle seal. Okay. I gotta be way more careful with my power. But we still did it. We still did it. Oh my goodness. So I think that is the play on how to deal with Mangle. Mangle, you gotta treat like Springtrap. Balloon Boy, you obviously have to treat like Toy Bonnie. Toy Chica just does whatever she wants in the vents. And then Toy Freddy, you have to use the lights to get him away. Oh my goodness. I'd want to do more, but I'd have to save that for part two. Oh man, I cannot wait to see what nights three or nights four through six will look like. Well, make sure you guys stay tuned for that one because that part will be coming soon. But with that being said, I'm going to go conclude the video here. So thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.